Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Linux Temple and today I'm going to present you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to get dash to dock extension on your Ubuntu PC or in any other Linux distribution with GNOME as its desktop environment. I'll start with the very basic thing. I'll start with installing GNOME extension and then GNOME tweak tool and then we'll integrate GNOME extension tool on our Mozilla Firefox browser. Okay, let's get into the topic. And for this, you need to go to the Ubuntu software and there you have to install GNOME extensions. So, search for GNOME extensions. And install it. Your password. So, after installing GNOME extensions, you can also install GNOME Tweak Tools for some extra customization options. So here we have GNOME Tweak Tools. So install it. After installing this, go to menu. So there we have extensions. So if it's disabled by default, you can enable it. And now we're going to integrate GNOME extensions with the Mozilla Firefox browser. So go to the website extensions.gnome.org. So first you have to install browser extension. So from there, we can download and install. We can add browser extension on the Firefox browser. So there we have GNOME extension. Just click on it. And there you can see the list of different GNOME extension tools available. So we are going to simply search for dash to dock. So here we have, so now we are going to add, just turn it on, stall, so this may take few seconds. So there in the extensions, we can see GNOME extension dash to dock. We can enable or disable this. So we are going to customize this by clicking on the gear icon. So first we are going to hide this intelligently so as any window overlaps to the dock it will hide automatically. And we are going to place this dock at the bottom of the desktop like a macOS dock. So I guess this looks better than before. And the desk that you can see there will disappear as you log out and log in again. You can turn it off as well. So in this way we can add dash to dock extension on the Ubuntu desktop. So guys this much for today and I hope you like this video and if you still have some confusions please comment down below and please support our channel by subscribing to us and press the bell icon for more Linux tutorial videos. Thanks for watching. Have a nice time.